Hi, this is James from Drone Deer Services. And in this video, we have some highlights of, from previous videos regarding early buck activity. So we are in May, and here you can see a group of thermal signatures. Uh, we discovered that these were all antlered deer. And you'll see them kind of align themselves as they move across this particular parcel. Uh, we processed the deer. You can see that group uh, kind of getting in line along the deer trail there. And we're going to explore some of the activity and some of the behavior. So now we have five deer all land, lined up in a row going across a uh, deer trail. I believe they are heading from food to bedding. Here are three antlered deer here, a lighter, a brown, um, and a gray, kind of interesting, the different uh, coat colors. So here's two mature mature um, whitetails, and then they're next to or close to two younger whitetail bucks. Uh, you can see the particular difference in the body sizes, but you know here we have light brown, medium brown, and gray uh, for coat. And that's kind of interesting. Not sure how that happens. Not sure which of these three is the oldest deer. I would guess the medium brown. But um, can't tell. Now we have them all three lined up. Uh, coming down a little bit. You can see antlers. The gray and the brown are kind of wide. Uh, they're going to be some uh, mature deer. Um, but... Uh, just wanted to kind of put this highlight together. Uh, the deer came off the food plot, basically, or or feeding area. It's not really a food plot. And get in line. And here we have four deer in line. Um, a, the immature deer, the young deer, is in the lead. The two older deer are second and third. And another younger buck. In fact, two younger bucks are bringing up the rear. But notice how they stick to the trails and as they move um, off this uh, vegetation. It's kind of interesting. I just kind of wanted to highlight it. And we'll uh, continue these kind of highlighted uh, drone deer services, uh, shorter uh, clips. So uh, just help educate folks. So the yearling moves in. The rest of the team stays back. I, I'm not sure what kind of a uh, communication is held, uh, but then the rest of the group uh, moved into the what I would say is their bedding area. Once they get in here, they're hard to discover. You can see the thickness, but I did get a glimpse of the what I'll call the gray buck. Here comes the medium brown buck, and uh, they're going off to uh, what I believe is. Uh, to bed. This was going to be a 80 degree day with sun, so I'm assuming they're finding shade, but um, th that's an assumption and, and not necessarily uh, what exactly happened here. But um, just wanted to kind of excerpt um, this particular footage from a prior video that was longer, and if um, you like what we do here, let us know. Drone Deer Services, like and subscribe. Email us comments. We're here to help and um, have a great day.